can run on water I'm picking up the speed Cause you will always be the Okay, so I am making Jalen's bed. I'm trying to like clean up in here and stuff. And the baby wouldn't fall asleep, so I had to put these here to make it look like she actually had someone next to her. She's always used to having someone by her. So I had to line up Jalen's little buddies here so she can actually fall asleep while mommy's cleaning. We are on the way. I have Jason here and just Jason. It's just Jay. There he goes. <laughs> it's just us. We're going to um, head over to a store called Five Below. For those of you from Jersey, you guys know what it is because, you know, we had it up there. But down here, a lot of people don't know what it is. And it's pretty new to a lot of the cities and towns and villages in Florida. So we are really excited because we have one. It's literally like maybe it's less than 10 minutes away so we're excited about it and that's where we're going but we thought on the way um for us on the way there <laughs> we would play a game called catchphrase i don't know if you guys have ever heard of catchphrase but it's a lot of fun my mother-in-law left the game for us and um we've been addicted to it we've been playing it like almost non-stop mm -hmm. <laughs> So we're gonna go ahead and play a round or two um, on the way to Five Below. So right. Jay's gonna start and he's gonna give me the clues and I'm gonna try to answer as best as I can. So basically this first clue, this is what I want you guys to do while you watch this video. All right, <laughs> uh -oh. let's go. Um, all right, ah, oh, I skipped it. It was sit tight, but anyway. Sit tight. Okay. Um, Okay, uh, w a different kind of car. Not, uh, they're big. SUV? It's the same. SUV? No, uh, oh, with uh, a lot of wheels. A bus? No, um, uh, <laughs> um, it has a, <laughs> they, they, um, they have cargo on it and, you know, they take RV. it. RV? No. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, forget are, it. It's you are a, not explaining this well. Yeah, it's a, it's a saying. And. It's about, um, okay, look at that vehicle over there. What is that? Uh, a truck? Yeah, okay. Um, if you want something, if you hold on to it, it you what it? You, you take it, no. you um, grab? Okay. Keep on trucking. Grab? I don't know how, I wouldn't have known how to say that one. This I is fail. a really bad round. <laughs> All right, we're going to try this again. Oh, right. I hope that this one will be better. We should go back to entertainment. Entertainment was a lot better when right, we played. Entertainment. <laughs> Variety was kind of... All right, entertainment. It's just a little bit of everything. All right, ready? Go. Oh, um, Natalie Portman was in this movie. It's about... um, It's a ballet. It's a kind of ballet. Black Swan. Uh-huh. Um, 
Ooh, okay, uh, in Atlantic City, what, what's that area Zenos. called um, in the front with the woods? Uh, where we went to Seaside. Uh huh. Okay, now there, um, it's there's a show with um, the main character's name is Lucian. Um, it's with uh, Taraji P. Henson and what's his face? Oh my god, I can't oh, remember his oh, name. Oh, uh, oh. The music labels. Empire. Uh huh, so put them together. Boardwalk Empire. Empire Boardwalk. Go. No, the, uh, Boardwalk Empire. Okay. Oh, um, okay, uh, the name for um, the parent. Um, usually the female parent the that mom, is mother, uh-huh, but, uh huh no, but that's always like in the pageants or shows. Oh, and pageant she, mom. No, no, another one. There's a different one. Uh, in theater, that's what I should have said. Theater. Theater. Stage mother. Oh, stage mother. Yeah. Alrighty. This, well, is, this is a lot harder than it looks. Yeah. Let me tell you, it's a lot harder. When we park, I'll do a round or two just so you guys can see him guessing. Because I'm not gonna do it while I'm driving, obviously. But shall we try one more round? Yeah, let's do it. We're another. almost there. I told you, we're yeah. not that far. Alrighty, ready? Ready. Oh, um, okay, it's an award, not the Oscars. Um, uh, for daytime, daytime award. Emmy awards. Uh huh, but um, a person who is. A nominee? Uh huh, just put them together. Emmy nominee? Uh huh. Um, not MySpace, but. Facebook. Um,. Oh, uh, black female rapper, young. Um, she's like Little Kim, or she has beef with Little Kim. Uh huh. The biggest shuttlecock I've ever seen. Spit up or swat? <laughs> Take your pick. <laughs> you better to be my little bug. I'm sorry. Mommy's at the doctor's. Turn my hot for milk really quick. See how quickly we get that warmed up. I'm trying to calm her down. Right? Mommy's trying to keep you calm. So I just got out of the doctor's office and he sent me straight to go get um, ultrasounds done on my legs, on both of my legs, to see if there are any blood clots. So um, I have to go and get it done like right now as soon as possible because if there is, they will send me straight to the hospital from there. So I will keep you guys updated. I am heading over to go pick up Jason because I have the girls and I need him to help me watch the kids. So. Let me hurry up and get that done, but I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. Hey guys, so it is Friday, TGIF. Yay. Excited Friday's here. And yesterday, I didn't get to update you guys, but I went over to get the ultrasound done, and everything is fine. Thank God, no blood clots or anything. They did uh, both legs just to make sure that, you know, it wasn't, um, you know any blood clots or anything causing the swelling so everything is fine and my doctor put me on like diuretic pills so hopefully it's just that I'm retaining water and hopefully the medication will work um, but yeah so that's a good thing I'm excited I'm happy that it's nothing bad mm. she's just not happy she does not like being in the car and we're not moving I, yeah. she's starting to like the motion of the car which is good but she didn't like the car seat at first and she didn't like being in the car at first and we were a little nervous because you know we go to orlando quite a bit and that's like a two and a half hour drive so we didn't know whether or not she was going to handle that when we start going up to disney and stuff so hopefully she'll do well she's doing better hopefully when we start driving she would just 
stay calm. But um, yeah, so we are on the way to the mall to go meet up with Adi and Angela and Olivia. They are on a chorus field trip and they stop there, you know, to have lunch sometimes. So we are heading over to meet up with them and have lunch and then that's it. And then we'll see what we're gonna do later. I have every intention of taking the kids to go get helmets because you know we're gonna do a lot of um you know a lot of bike riding this this we're summer so saying. hopefully yeah they're out today it's friday um but hopefully you know we can get out and enjoy the summer and they can go bike riding quite a bit and now that i have the green light for my doctor to go ahead on my day-to-day -day activities and my normal activities i can actually join them in bike riding so i'm excited about that um, so yeah, so that's what we're doing, and again, we have no idea what we're doing this weekend. I know Sunday we're going to be celebrating Luna's birthday, and then Saturday I'm not sure yet. So again, <coughs> stay tuned to see what we get into this weekend. Hopefully it's something. Last weekend we didn't do much, but hopefully we'll be out there this weekend if all goes well anyway. So we'll see you guys, if not the mall, then wherever we end up next. Right, so this is funny. We're trying to take a selfie with Jason's phone, and he after keeps, like six attempts, it's still just me. And <laughs> he's trying to get both of us in there, but it's only me. <laughs> Your phone probably just loves me. Sorry. Oh my god! <laughs> I find it so cute when she has these little bubbles on her lips. There she goes. I see her. Tristan up now from school and we were having a discussion I meant to mention it before I don't know if I don't think I did I don't remember because I would have gotten a little heated from it I was talking about it with Angela during lunch but yesterday while I was at the doctor's office some lady came over she walked over to me like across the waiting room and like heels and she looked very Miami-ish like you know one of those Miami Spanish girls with blonde hair short dress high heels and she walked over to like where we were sitting it was me Jalen and and Mila and you know I was trying to I was tapping Jalen on her I mean Jalen I was tapping Jalen on her back yes I was tapping Mila on her back to try to get her to burp because she had just eaten so um you know we were just sitting there and talking and stuff and this lady comes over and she literally without asking or anything she just starts touching Mila so I kind of like, I didn't want to be rude or anything, so I was just like pulling her back. Um, because you know, you don't want anyone just touching your baby, let alone anyone who has not sanitized their hands or anyone in a doctor's office. And she was there for a reason, so I'm pretty sure she had something which makes me nervous. But So she goes and she tries to touch her and I like push away from her and I'm still talking to her but like inching away from her. And then we went and she asked like a couple minutes later after talking so she's like can i hold your baby and i'm like i'm sorry i don't feel comfortable with you holding her and after that she got up and like walked away but where does it oh and actually after that when i went to go get the ultrasound done nieko was in the waiting room waiting for me and he had mila and her diaper bag looking through the diaper bag and stuff I, I don't know if it was for her pacifier or something he was trying to find something and this lady saw him like holding the baby and trying to go through the bag so she was like can I hold the baby while you're you know you're looking through the bag okay maybe she was just trying to be helpful but I don't know I don't normally walk around asking people to hold their babies so is that just a Florida thing I, I mean I even asked Angela about it because she did have her daughter here and she said no she said she's never been approached for anyone to hold her child so it's weird that it happened twice 
yesterday and it's been the only time but twice in one day random strangers and doctor's offices all right so we're looking for helmets for the kids you like that one up there the gray one the one with the lights on mm -hmm. the blue one i have to see if that's your size tristan which one do you like um which one do i like yeah You like the red one? Yeah. Yeah, we can take a look at that one. Yeah. You like that one? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't see your face. <laughs> you like this one? Is it comfortable? Yeah, I feel yeah. very comfortable. Mommy has to actually strap I love it, it, I love it, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. <laughs> so do you think, J Jalen, do you think Adi will like this one? Yeah. It's the only one in her size, so I think we're going to get that one for Adi. Yeah. Look, look at this little guy there. Tristan, what are you doing? Sitting here. Sitting here. <laughs> like it's a normal thing we do. We just sit down the aisles, right? Bye. All right, so we're getting this one for Adi. And we're getting the rest of that stuff there. We should be asking the magical eight ball. Will I get a date this year? Ooh. Very doubtful. <gasps> so angry at it. That was actually sad. Yeah. Well, it's not going to show it now. I uh, know. You moved it. Try it again. It might be wrong. <laughs> Two out of three? <laughs> well, I get a date this year. <laughs> what did it say? It said very doubtful <gasps> again. Two times in a row. Come on, guys. Nope. <laughs> We need to set him up on a date. No. Will I go yeah. to fourth yeah. grade? No Would you go to fourth grade? That's a good question. It better say yes. You're looking not, at I'm the wrong side, you. honey. <laughs> you have to hold it flat like that. <gasps> As I see it, yes. Yay! Very good. <laughs> we know Tristan is, right, Tristan? You found out today? I'm not sure what. What grade are you going to next year? Fourth. Fourth? You excited? Yes. Yeah. Mommy's excited too. That means I passed like the diagnostics of the FSA. High five. I knew you would. <laughs> that's that's scary. If that went out, could you imagine that going off like at night? In the middle of the night. <laughs> I don't like that. Found some retro stuff. <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen, but still. Did you have Tristan do it? Do you do it, Tristan? No. No, come on, try yeah. it. Try it. Fine. Oh God. <laughs> All of these dolls, and I focus on this sign here. Okay, can you guys focus on that? Uh, it'll almost focus. It says our generation deluxe posable Hispanic doll is on sale. What does it say? The Hispanic doll <laughs> is the wow. only one on sale. <laughs> what? Wow. That's interesting. Okay, and then if you go by Hispanic doll, which one would it be? There's Isa, Blanca. there's Blanca, and there's Aura. Aura sounds Spanish. Adelita sounds Spanish. Excuse me. Which one is the Hispanic doll? We took Adelita. Oh, and she comes with pierced ears. Oh, look at that sassy. Mm -hmm. Sassy Adelita. She's cute though. Which one? Yeah, which one is? It has to be that Hispanic one. I think it's that one down there. How funny would it be though but to Blanc ask them? Blanca, right? Blanca is Spanish. But Adelita is Spanish too. How funny would it be to go up there and be like, which one of these is Hispanic? Because only she's on sale. Mm -hmm. I like the sassy one though. This one's cute too. Have you guys ever seen these? 
they have little stories behind them. Now there's more Spanish ones here, Lilia. I can't even tell what that looks like. Karma or Carmen, something with a K. Um, Ariana and Alejandra. They they all sound Spanish. And Valencia. Oh look at Valencia. She's pretty, Jalen. <laughs> You're sitting now. Mm, are you excited? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna go get your bike. You're mm. gonna go try it out and see if you like it? Yep. Yep. But we have to return your helmet because it didn't fit, so we're gonna go it see what we my have. Head. It hurts my head. It shouldn't hurt your head. Look, you're setting off sparkles with your shirt. <laughs> so Adi is helping us pick a doll for Luna for her birthday. We've kind of narrowed it down to these. I think she looks like Luna. And she's into sweets and stuff, which is Luna 100%. But Jalen really likes her doll, so we thought Luna would like it too. I don't know. It's Jenny. Jenny, I think, is the winner. Yes. Come on, Jenny, let's go. So do you like the way that one feels? Yeah, you like it? We just have to get one from up there. That one has a flat tire.